this is how you repair a classic uh, floater on a Toyota. Uh, this comes with uh, Dolphin models, Toyo Ace models, High Ace models, Dyna models, and uh, this is very easy and uh, this doesn't go bad uh, easily like other floaters. Uh, uh, most of the time, what will happen is uh, you can see uh, this contact point. Uh, it might be broken. You can resolve it. Or uh, uh, the other connection is connected. Uh, the other connection is actually this coil, uh, the resistance coil, which is soldered here. Uh, you can see a solder mark here so it's soldered here so this is actually a single line uh, what the floater does is it varies the resistance and uh, after uh, you'd, uh, you can uh, you can actually uh, remove this coil apart uh, by taking by uh, straightening this lock pin here and uh, it's not clear the lock pin here you can take the coil apart and you can check whether the coil is not broken if it's not broken uh, definitely you can repair it so solder one end here uh, actually uh, actually that, that is the one which is going to the coil so it's soldered here and uh, there's a rivet uh, copper part here and that is connected to the coil the otherwise uh, the earth or the same thing which is coming to the body which is connected to this floater so it will go to the other wire and uh, you can uh, keep a multimeter with resistance settings to this and put the floater up and down and check the resistance varying thing if it's varying it's working properly